2018 was a great year for movies, but there's only enough for 10 on this year list. So with the shitty ones out of the way, let's take a look at the best that last year had to offer. Suspiria is art house horror at its finest, with grotesque imagery, gorgeous direction, haunting music, and a prolonged drawn out runtime that leads to an utterly berserk ending. Until the fucking Switten? Oh my god. We the Animals is a very effective and honest and realistic tale of childhood that's full of pain and emotion and heart. It's beautifully made and acted, and overall is really very powerful. Spider Man Into the Spider Verse is extremely entertaining, and stylistically, it's mesmerizing to watch. It's clever and exciting and hilarious, and arguably, it's the best Spider Man movie we've ever gotten. Blind Spotting was such an interesting and genuinely funny take on heavy and intense subject matter. It juggles tone effortlessly, features stylized rap sequences, and has two great lead performances. Black Klansman is a very funny, very cool, and entertaining story with excellent lead performances and spot-on direction. It's well-written and has great music and has one of the most emotionally impactful endings I've ever seen. Won't You Be My Neighbor is the sweetest, warmest documentary I've ever watched. It's truly a wonder to behold and you can feel the fucking kindness coming from Fred Rogers as you're watching it and it's a beautiful look into his life. A Star is Born is such a timeless story and features wonderful music and performances and direction. The romantic chemistry is on fucking point and it's emotional and bittersweet and really fantastic overall. The Sisters Brothers is a brilliant send-up of the tropes and conventions found in the Western genre. It's very funny and engaging, constantly defies expectations, and features some of my favorite actors giving outstanding performances. First Reformed is a quietly intense and disturbing tale of faith and self-destruction. It has incredible performances and direction, and it shot so fucking well, and it very slowly escalates to a haunting and unsettling conclusion. Roma is a gorgeously filmed, beautifully acted, and intimate portrayal of motherhood. It has unbelievable cinematography and was full of so much sadness and love, and it was a truly mesmerizing watch. 